Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be looking at a Sapaco Meal Individual Reduced Sodium. These are the commercially commercially available uh, rations that are available to purchase on Amazon, eBay, plenty of places. We've got uh, vegetable lasagna as our menu. If you'd like to take out check out the nutrition facts and ingredients uh, you can pause the camera and do so so uh, before we rip into this one guys um, if you could take a moment to subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell I would really graciously greatly appreciate that it will means it means a lot to me um, helps me keep making these videos so let's go ahead and get into it Got our peelable seal here So we've got vegetable crackers. Uh, we're just gonna read the, so this is a 2017 ration. Plenty fresh. We have a standard FRH. We have a very interesting accessory kit. It literally has just a napkin. Napkin. Some Papa's Perfect salt-free seasoning, which is uh, not good anymore. It's been compromised, it feels. And some pepper. We have some good old apple jelly. One ounce. Feels okay. We have another pack of apple jelly. Two jellies. Standard MRE spoon. We have a brown toaster pastry. Our main vegetable lasagna. And we have our heater sleeve. So if you'd like to take, I think we already, you guys already checked that one out. There was only one heater sleeve in there. And a tissue roll. Sweet. Well, we got no salt packet for our <clears throat> FRH, so we'll just go ahead and see if this thing will fire without salt. Right. Let's try to see if I can get the line here. It doesn't take very much at all. A little bit more. All right. So we got it to the first line. I'm going to set it down. See if we can't get something out of it. Alright, it's trying to do its thing, so we will go ahead and stick our main in here. I also noticed that we did not get a drink with this ration. <clears throat> I will lean it up over here. Just like so. tree let's check out our toaster pastry it is a Kellogg pop tart uh, brown sugar cinnamon it has been squished <laughs> I don't think it's actually been squished. I think what happens is this happens during the uh, vacuum sealing process because they they do vacuum seal those pretty pretty good. So 
So we got one of that. And then two. There's actually two there, but it, yeah, it's pretty compacted down. So we got that. We got crumbs everywhere. Let's get out this uh, crackers. Tear it on this side. Nope. Nice little hiss. There you are. Or a little. Well, the heater was going and now it stopped. I'm actually going to just lay it down. Let's try out some of this apple jelly here. Now, as you can tell, this is a pretty small ration. Kind of simple, straight to the point. A little bit brown on the uh, jelly there. We do have another pack, but we're just going to use the one cracker. Have our spoon. All right, let me check this out, uh, heater out. Okay, so sadly our heater is not working, so we get a cold meal. Sometimes that's just the way it works. You know, if we would have had salt, I bet it would have fired, but that's all right. We can make do. There's your Tootsie Roll. Go ahead and get this guy out. We are doing pretty good with the uh, with the eaters. We're getting a lot of them to work. That is one nice thing about these rations, though, is that uh, they all come pre-cooked, and you can't eat them cold. And that's what we're going to do. There you are. Hmm. Smells good right away. Nice. I'm getting this very strong smell of... Uh, tomato sauce actually so there we are wow <laughs> uh, it's like eating cold spaghetti not bad at all it's got a little bit of a, a sweetness to it Uh, I don't see anything that has vegetable at all. Throw us a little bit of pepper in there. Oh, wait a minute. I do believe I found a green chili. Oh. And there's some beans in here as well. There you are. All right. Well, to be honest with you, I can't even say that it's half bad because it's not bad at all. Not bad at all. Hmm.
honestly, I'd have to say that it's hard to tell between this if it was a meat or vegetable. Honestly, it's not bad. That's a good meal. Let's try our cracker. Of course, it's going to break everywhere. The cracker's not stale. The apple jelly, I think, needed to be mixed a little bit more. It's not too sweet. All in all, I think it was pretty good. Get a piece of this cracker and we will break it up and try it in the lasagna. Boy, those crackers are sure messy. Alright, there we go. Hmm. Nice little touch. Still ain't half bad. Alright. Let's check out our toaster pop. There you go. Toaster pop. Taste as it should. It'd be really good if it was heated up. This whole meal, even though it's from 2015 or 2017, that's pretty fresh. You know, I do have some water here. I still have a cans of these quench all. So let's go ahead and give it a try. This was uh, Best Buy 2052. Isn't that insane? I mean, that's really good for a can of water. E. Quenchall. I'll try to leave a link in the description for both of these. It just tastes like um, really good filtered water. That's about it. Says it's got electrolytes in it. Leech free. Infinitely recyclable. Purify oh, purified and fresh for 30 years. 30 year can. Wow. Amazing technology that we have now. Go ahead and try this out. I'm sorry, guys. The plate's kind of... Crackers just kind of messed me up. Super fresh. Could never go wrong with a touchy roll. Let me show you what I was talking about on the seasoning. This is what always happens with these. We've had these in di di different, uh, different ones, but this is what always happens right here. It just clumps up. See? Not good. So, all right, guys. That will do it for this one. Um, still trying to get to the hit that hit that 400, and then we'll then we'll start we'll start talking about a giveaway.
but uh, it's still getting there. But we'll get there soon enough. So uh, anyway, guys, until next time, have a good one.